Hello, my YouTube family. Uh, I came home a little late. I had a drive through situation. You know I'm not going to cook anything before Thanksgiving, right? So if there isn't really much food, and there really isn't, there's food, but there isn't much food, you know. So I'm waiting for the much food on Thursday. So if I don't really have anything, like, prepared to just heat and eat, I go through the drive through <clears throat> so I just came back from the drive-thru. Thank you very, very much. Okay, so let us start with lips of the day. My lights are doing, they're just not cooperating, people, so bear with me. Bear with me. I've had, like, a scare with my phone this morning. and Well, actually, it was this afternoon. Like, it just wouldn't turn on. It just wouldn't turn on. But I knew I, I recharged the phone, like, two or three days ago. And it usually takes about a week or so before it starts to, the battery starts to die. Well, maybe the battery is dying earlier for some reason. I don't know. My phone is old. When I tell you that this phone was so damn dead that it took almost two hours to, to recharge the battery, that's how dead it was. And it scared me to pieces because I was like, okay, why? Why is it taking so long to recharge? took so long because that's the time that it needed to, to recharge, Nancy. Finally, it said battery charge completed. I was like, thank you, sweet Jesus. Turned it back on. Woo! Everything, lights and all the fancy stuff was going. I'm like, okay, this is good. But when I tell you, when I tried to turn on my phone and all I got was complete darkness, and you know when your heart just skips a beat and it's like, because you know you don't have dime one for a new anything. Anything mechanical, technical, anything of that nature. And I don't get paid again until the 30th, people. <clears throat> okay, so in the 30th, I don't go to work. Okay, enough of that. Uh, two down, one more to go, and tomorrow is out at three. Thank you. So, yeah. Let me, let me do lips of the day and let me tell you what happened last night. Okay, so lips of the day. I have done a lip look on this before. Let us start with the lip liner. Now my nose is running. <clears throat> I'm doing a lot of this. <clears throat> Coughing all day. Hmm. Not happy. The liner is NYX Deep Purple. Lined and filled is... Uh, not so popular, almost no name, but yet as a name brand that you can find in like Dwayne Reed, which is where I found this one. It's called Brucci, Brucci lipstick, and they have a ton of like an array of colors. And this particular color is called, oh, can't see it, Frosted Grape, Frosted Grape. And this is what Frosted Grape looks like it's really it's more pinkyish than purplish it's coming across purple on the screen because that's what my lights feel like doing to it right now but let me do a swatch maybe the swatch will help it's like a purpley pink as you can tell on my lips it's like a purpley pink but it's more pink than purple and they go on so smooth this i thought it was a drying lipstick it's not rather moisturizing rather moisturizing so that is frosted grape i don't know why they call it frosted it's not a frosty lipstick frosted grape <clears throat> this is the color and this is the color you could check the other other video that i did on it to see the difference because maybe my lighting was better in the other one okay so that is brucci lipstick Frosted grape. Now, as to what happened, you know I always have a story. Well, sometimes I don't, but today, today I do. So, on Mondays and Tuesday nights, my father has the 12 to midnight shift. So, he doesn't leave here until like 11. He starts to prepare at around 11, 10, 11, 15, and then he leaves the house at 11, 30, because it only takes him a little 20, 25 minutes, 30 like me to go to work 30 minute drive 
in a panic, I hear my father going, Nancy? Now, when he calls me Nancy, oh, that's serious business. So I said, what the hell did I do? Nancy, Nancy, could you come down here for a minute? I said, oh, okay, okay, here I come. He goes, you got to help me find my keys. I can't find my keys anywhere, and it's time for me to go to work. He had his jacket on. I mean, he was just, he was literally out, ready to go out the door. And he couldn't lock the door because he had no keys. So we are tearing the house apart to the point where after 45 minutes, I said, Pop, we, we may have to call a locksmith or something because he want, he thought he was convinced that he had left his keys in the garage and he walked out and locked the garage with the keys still inside. So a spare, we need to find a spare. He finally found a spare, opened the garage door. They're not there, but at least he found a spare. So, okay, now we know we have a spare to the garage. That's one, that's one relief, but that's not really what we need right now. We need to find his keys. I asked the man, are you wearing the same pants and jacket that you wore earlier this morning? Well, yeah, you know, of course I am. And I, they're not here. They're not here. Okay, so we're looking, looking. Look, I'm talking about we destroyed the house. We destroyed the house. I ransacked it is what we did downstairs in the basement downstairs all over i'm downstairs in the basement he's upstairs in the living room he's talking to himself now he's speaking in creole and now you know it's he can't believe it he can't believe it why is this happening to him and so i'm finally in the sunroom in his boy's room men's room you know man cave i'm tearing that apart again and he goes, Nan, and I said, oh, he found them. And I hear him jiggling them in his, in his hands. So I said, where were they? He said, I changed my pants. I said, didn't I ask you if you were wearing the same clothes? Yeah, yeah. I, he goes, I did check the pants. I checked the pants, and I didn't feel them the first time. And something told me to go check them again. I said, well, it's a good thing something was right. So my nose is running. Oh, man, I'm a hot mess over here. So, and before all of this, he had to call the guy who he's relieving to let the guy know he's going to be late. Could you just wait until he gets there to change the shift? So that thankfully wasn't too long. He called the guy again. He said, I'm on my way. I found my keys, blah, blah, blah. And off he went. Now, mind you, I go to sleep at 12 midnight. And he didn't find his keys until about 1230. Now, you know. I came up here dead as a dog, and I just went to bed. When I tell you, I put my head down, and all I heard was, dee, dee. I said, no, 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 I just put my head down. I just put my head down, so alarm, you are in the wrong. It's time to wake up. So that was the adventure of last night, which I hope never, ever repeats itself, either his way or my way. I definitely try to put everything away in the same place like my keys are in my purse in the same pocket that they've always been since the first time and and sarah this is the purse that you gave me i'm still using that purse girl it's a hot mess now because it's every, it carries everything but in, but the kitchen sink so you know this bag is loaded it's just loaded so i keep my keys in the same pocket i keep my phone in the same pocket i keep my my money in the same pocket so when I, sometimes I'll reach and I don't find what I'm supposed to find. Oh, no, no. That's when I go into panic mode. Come to find out it slipped out the pocket and into the purse itself. So I, all this time I still have it with me. But if it's not in the place where I originally keep it, I start to panic. I know. I know. It's old age, people. It's old age on me. It's old age on pop. <clears throat> we got to look out for each other, okay? Okay, that's it, really. That's that's really it. Um, even though I went through the drive-thru, I have my food here. I'm not really hungry right now. So I'm just going to max and relax, unwind. But you know by the time it's time to unwind, it's time to go to bed, right? But tomorrow we get out early. That is all I'm concerned about. We get out early tomorrow. So I'm very, very happy about that. And on that note, and on that note,
I am going to call it a night. I know it's rather early for me, right? Going to call it a night. Let me know what you think. And uh, I will talk to you tomorrow. Okay? I will talk to you tomorrow. And I will talk to you tomorrow. Okay? I'm, I'm just I'm just too through. Is it, was there anything that you had to watch? That Gotham? I watched I, 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 I watched Gotham, and I taped something else. Oh, I think I taped Housewives of something, or is that tonight? You know what, people? I'll talk to you tomorrow, all right? I'm a hot mess my, my own damn self. I love you. I will talk to you tomorrow. Hit me up and let me know what you think. Mwah. Bye now.